Hello everybody of YouTube, this is Ryze96 here with another requested toy review. Um, today I will be reviewing my Trendmasters 1998 Godzilla or Zilla or Gino or whatever anybody calls them. But uh, yeah, there's going to be a little, it's not going to be the best toy review because well, his leg is just deformed. He can't stand right. Fall, it makes him fall over. So, yeah, I'll try to keep him like this for the whole review. So, alright, I'll get started. First, for the articulation, he can go... I don't think he can go 360 with his legs. Um, he can go 360 with his arms. Uh, his hands can go 360. Um, his feet can go back and forth, or his, uh, whatever you call it, knee, and his feet go back and forth, and then his tail, 360. Yeah. Alright, now, detail. I like, this is actually a really nice detailed figure. Um, like, you can see his gills or whatever you call them on his neck all of his scales everywhere little dots scales some of the paint scheme is off on mine though cause well I got this off of ebay um it wasn't the best obviously because of the the light defect um yeah Nice detail all around though. His mouth. Inside of his mouth. It's just pink. I think they could have done like a little more on that. Because it doesn't even look like a tongue. It's just painted pink. Even on the top. Um, the orange eyes. I would have changed the color of them. Maybe, I don't know, black or something. Just not orange. It just doesn't look right. Um, spikes. I like, they're really nice, I think. They all go down to at least like at the real tip of the tail. Yeah, it's a nice, nice figure. Uh, like Deadzilla said in his review of him, uh, I, he's just too skinny. Um, and he has like a really big just head part it's half of his body um I'd really fix that yeah but uh all around this is a really good figure um compared to your other figures like Final Wars Godzilla um size comparison depends how you have them um, yeah, it's, it's okay, I'd say. Um, yeah. Fits in nice with him. Um, this is actually probably one of the harder, really harder, actually, I'd say, figures to find. Um, you can get them on eBay. I think that is pr pretty much the only place you can get them for. Well, I got mine for 10 bucks, but right after I bought him, I saw a lot of other ones um, from anywhere from five bucks to 20 bucks. Um, that is, yeah, that's pretty much the only place to get them. Um, I give them probably an eight out of 10. Just because his detail and like sculpt and everything is just really amazing, but he could have been a lot bulkier or something, and a smaller head part right here. Uh, but yeah. So uh, yeah, that has been another requested toy review by Rides96. See you guys.